Hey, what's up? Uh, I'm going to do a tutorial for Cinema 4D on how to get really nice looking 3D text. So you're going to want to open up Cinema 4D, obviously. So once you have that open, you're going to want to go MoGraph, MoText, bring in a text object. Just like that. And then move it wherever you're gonna want to make the depth you can do like a hundred or like 90 but I'm gonna do 80 I think and then you can make the text whatever you want oh, it's like this okay so I I made my text now so you're going to want to pick a cool font. Uh, I'm going to do Slant. So it's kind of it's kind of a cool font. So you make this centered. And then a really important step is to go caps. You want to go fill cap, fill cap. You can do two th and three but I'm gonna do three four or you can do four five as well but I'm gonna do three four so that gives the text a round edge so it's not just like straight and then you're gonna want a material a nice uh, nice color I'm gonna do green a light green and you want to go up reflection make sure you ch you have it checked and then you're going to want to go texture fresno and so that has a like a really nice reflection on there and then you can drag it on here and that's your color but you can tell it doesn't look very good right now because you have no light or soft boxes so if you don't, you can go window, content browser, and if you don't have grayscale gorillas uh, light kits or this stuff, then you can just use a normal light. But this is really helpful. So I'm gonna do an overhead softbox and a normal softbox, just like that. So now that now that thing has light there. And now, now when you give it a render, it really looks awesome. And then you can save it as a PNG or whatever and bring it into Photoshop for backgrounds or, because I know of quite a few people that make backgrounds, that they make really good YouTube backgrounds, but the text is, it's got no reflection and doesn't really look very good. But anyways, there you go. See ya.